What's going on, everybody? It's just another day in the kitchen, back with another episode. And you know, they say the devil works hard, but honestly, the kitchen works harder. If you didn't know, today Kanye West and his team uploaded the merch for his upcoming album, Vultures. Yes, you heard that right. Allegedly, Ye, the artist formerly known as Kanye West, has got a collaboration album with Ty Dolla Sign coming this upcoming Friday. And as we know, with any great album release, there's of course some great merch to match it. So we're going to be reviewing that in this video today. Now, it is, of course, anyone's best guess if Vultures actually releases this upcoming Friday, like they said, because it is, of course, Kanye. However, the hype for this album is real. If you haven't been following the latest news, Kanye and his team have touched down and landed in my home state of Florida, where they're currently getting lit in Miami where there's an ongoing art festival every single year called Art Basel, where celebrities show out, artists show out, and it's a really good time. Now, things started to heat up and get spicy in Miami down there today when some big Kanye West Twitter pages tweeted the following information. Basically, if you headed over to Yeezy.com, there was the opportunity to sign up with your email to purchase some tickets to the listening event for this evening. This basically solidified that yes, today in Wynwood at midnight at 12, 12, 12, we're going to get a listening party for this upcoming Vultures album. And honestly, if you're a fan of Kanye or music, you know things are about to get lit. Now, in addition to this exciting listening party news in Miami today, we also got our first wave and look at the upcoming Vultures merch. I was actually really excited to see what this was going to look like, given that it was, of course, going to be a new Kanye album. However, I'm not really sure what to think. As you can see right off the bat, it is pretty limited, and although I like to edit my videos, I'm actually going to show you guys what this looked like as I was recording it, because the website was very buggy. And I found that I wasn't actually able to add anything to cart, nor click on any actual product. I tried to click on the additional links and tabs, however nothing actually loaded, and I got the same kind of 404 error. Now one thing I did think was kind of cool is when you clicked on that trash bag that it was actually your cart. And this pod sock shoe was the only actual product you could interact with, with two different ranges of sizes as you guys can see. Now for us Kanye sneakerheads, this one might not be the most exciting because he's obviously produced a lot more interesting things. However, if you've been keeping up with him in general over the last couple of months, you've seen that his footwear choices have definitely reflected this style. And it's not the first time he's actually worn this kind of thing over the years because it was during that Jesus is King era, as you can see pictured here, that he was also spotted wearing some prototypes just a couple of years ago. And honestly, while we're on the topic of the sock shoes, I want to go ahead and make the bold claim that I think this is going to set the pace and tone for the future of footwear just in general. And I definitely want to back that claim up by pointing out how Kanye basically led the wave when it came to the whole Yeezy slide wave that we've seen in the most recent years. I feel like once he started putting out his Yeezy slides and foam runners, we saw other brands follow similarly with other attempts. Now, Kanye over the last couple of months has of course laid low, but it's been over the last couple of weeks that he's been spotted wearing some other Vultures related merch. Now, unfortunately, we didn't get these pieces uploaded to the drop today, and I wouldn't be surprised if we actually get a corrected drop, of course, when the album drops this upcoming Friday. And if we do, you already know your boy's going to cook up a new video update on that one. However, I just wanted to show you guys some expected pieces we may see. Kanye has, of course, been wearing some kind of similar turban style when he's been spotted out in public, so I honestly wouldn't be surprised if we do see some form of headwear or scarf or something like that when it comes to this merch. And another thing I wanted to point out is that with Kanye's most recent Donda listening parties, there were some exclusive merch pieces that were available there, so I would also keep an eye out if you're lucky enough to attend the Miami one tonight, because I wouldn't be surprised if we also see something similar. And although Kanye is known for changing the release dates of his albums at the last minute, I am actually hype and excited for this Vultures album because I think that there's a whole lot of momentum going around it. I actually uploaded this clip initially of Kanye West performing Can't Tell Me Nothing at Club Live this past weekend. However, YouTube being YouTube struck me with a copyright. So let's just pretend Kanye's performing this and everybody's loving it in a sold out club performance. Now, like I mentioned, the team actually touched down in Miami, and people had the opportunity to see him. Most people were pretty lit to see Kanye perform in the club like this, and although a lot of people mentioned that he was dressed like a Sith Lord, they said that the hype is real. Now, with all that being said, I wanted to wrap up this video with just a couple of my own thoughts. I think that this release is going to be definitely interesting because a lot has changed since Kanye's last album, Donda, release. 
Back then, I feel like he was kind of on top of the world, of course, with controversy. However, we know that he's obviously nuked and destroyed many bridges since then. With that being said, I'd like to know if that's actually changed your attitude towards him and if you're going to be skipping this actual album release and what do you think of the actual merch release so far? Although it wasn't very accessible or able to cart and there wasn't actually a whole lot going on besides the whole tube sock thing, I think that we will see some more available if this actually drops this upcoming Friday and hopefully those black pieces that we saw Kanye and Ty Dolla wearing. Honestly, I do hope that this album does come out and I hope that it is a return to form for Kanye because he is a legend, of course, and he has contributed a lot to the game. Now, with that being said, I will, of course, make an updated video when we get an official release and I do hope that you go ahead and like and subscribe. Let me know what you guys think about this video and who else you'd like to see me cover next in the future. And as always, guys, please stay safe out there. It's lit. Straight up and peace.